In this video, I'm going to be teaching you one way you can freeze your character and lock its movement. Actually, I'm going to be teaching you three different ways you can do that. Each of them are used for their own reasons. Alright, so the first way is by setting the walk speed to zero. You click play, you find your character, go to humanoid, and set your walk speed to zero. Now, if you try to move, you won't be able to. However, if a part is coming at you at supersonic speeds, it's going to move you. Here's how you can code it. Insert a local script. Make a variable for the player. Make a variable for the character. And make a variable for the humanoid. Set the walk speed to zero. And add a weight at the top. Test your game out. And your character cannot move. It can only jump. Here's way number two. Find your character, find your humanoid root part, and anchor it. Now, you can't move or jump. Wanna code it? Simple. Do everything we did before, but change humanoid to humanoid root part. And now just anchor it. Problem solved. Can't move my character. And the third way is by copying this code. This is basically context action service which will tell Roblox that you are no longer allowed to move and it will stop you from moving, period. This means that all inputs are disabled. That means if you try to do anything with your WASD keys or your spacebar or your arrow keys, Roblox will say no. All right, YouTube, thank you for watching and that is it for today. If you enjoyed this short video, then please like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.